Hola clase! This video is on how to conjugate reflexive verbs. Let's begin by copying down the definition of a reflexive verb. It's a verb that expresses actions that you do to yourself. For example, if I were to say, I look at myself in the mirror, that would be a reflexive verb because the action reflects back to the subject. I am the subject, and I'm also the thing that I am looking at. You can tell when a verb is reflexive because the end has a say on the end of it. So we know the term cepillarse los dientes, to brush your teeth. When we put it into a sentence, that say moves to the front of the verb and the ending of the verb changes. Now this can be really confusing because we're just used to changing the end, but let's look more closely at how this works. A reflexive pronoun. The reflexive pronoun, that's what this say is called on the end. It's just a small word that shows that the action is happening to the person's self. So if we put these in sentences, the reflexive pronoun is going to change based on the person talking. So if I am brushing my own teeth, that becomes me cepillo los dientes. And these words, the reflexive pronouns, basically tell the listener that it's myself, yourself, himself, herself, ourselves, themselves, or your, yourselves, plural. So make sure you pause the video to copy these things down. I'm going to move on to the next slide. Let's really dissect one of these reflexive verbs, sepillarse. We have the stem, like we're used to, and we have the ending, like we're used to. But we also have this extra piece, the reflexive pronoun. Just like we always have done, you change the end of the verb. I apologize, that's a mistake. It should say I brush instead of I speak. But you have o, as, a, amos, an to tell that I am the one brushing my teeth or you are the one brushing your teeth. There we go, I fixed it. Okay, now the extra part that we have to worry about is taking this reflexive pronoun, bringing it all the way to the beginning of the verb, and then changing that reflexive pronoun so that it matches the subject. May becomes, that goes in the beginning of the verb, and O goes on the end to tell that it's I brush. So the verb, when it's conjugated, will be me cepillo, te cepillas, se cepilla, nos cepillamos, se cepillan. And if you want to, you can add yo in front of this, tu in front of this, so it would be yo me cepillo, tu te cepillas. Él se cepilla. Nosotros nos cepillamos. Ellos se cepillan. Make sure you copy this down. If it helps, even to do different colors in your notes to show the, sub, the, the reflexive pronoun and the endings, that, that's fine with me. Let's check out these verbs in a chart so we can see the pattern of how these are working. I look at myself would be me miro, te miras, se mira, nos miramos, se miran. So the same endings that we're used to, the only extra piece are these reflexive pronouns. Let's look at some other ones. This is an ER verb and this is an IR verb. We have Yo me pongo, tú te pones, él o ella se pone, nosotros nos ponemos, ellos se ponen. So this would be, I put on myself a jacket or a sweater. You put on a shirt. 
Let's check out this IR verb, and it's a stem changer. So not only do we need to change the end and move the, the reflexive pronoun to the beginning, we also have to change the O to UE. So these things are getting more and more complicated. Yo me duermo. Tú te duermes. Él se duerme. Nosotros nos dormimos. Because it's nosotros form, we don't change the O. And then ellos se duermen. This is a lot of complicated stuff, but don't worry, we're going to practice it over and over in class. And any questions that you have, please feel free to jot them down in the margins of your notebook, and we will cover them in class. Let's remind ourselves that this is not the end of your homework. There's still one more piece that you have to finish, an entiendes quiz. So in the same folder underneath this video, there is a quiz that will determine whether or not this video really made sense to you. This is a lot of tricky stuff. So try out the mini, the mini quiz. It's only two or three questions, and that will help show whether or not this makes sense. If for some reason Schoology is not working, you can always email me the responses, but I will not accept the response if you just show me in class. I need to see it before you come to class. So here are the questions. When you're finished with the video, just go to the quiz and put your answers in. You want to conjugate the verbs based on what we saw in this video. That means yo form, the se moves to the front, it's going to change, and then the ar is going to change also. If you're not sure, you can always rewind the video and rewatch it. Carlos y yo blank los dientes después de comer el desayuno. Conjugate the verb cepillarse. And the last question, mis padres blank muy temprano. My parents go to bed very early. This is a stem changer, so not only will the AR change, the SE moves to the front, and the O is going to become a UE. So try your best, and even if you get them wrong, at least you will receive credit for trying.